And now Randy Orton's in control. It was all Triple H before this, but now Randy Orton just throwing punches at Triple H in the corner. Guys, this is a fight. They've told us enough on commentary. It's not your average match. Uh, my question, like, oh, Triple H spinning him round. Now Triple H throwing left and right. My question, though, is will this count on Triple H's record? Like, is this a certified actual match? Obviously, we know Triple H didn't compete at all last year in 2020. Uh, it's January 2021, and Triple H is competing on Raw. I never thought I'd say that. Uh, but, yeah, Triple H obviously in just normal street fight clothes. Uh, Randy Orton in his normal gear. Triple H not wearing his normal ring gear. They've spilled to the outside now. Randy Orton on firm control as of right now. Uh, just delivering a big uppercut. Uh, European uppercut to Triple H knocking him down. Now Irish whipping him. No, Triple H reverses it and sends Randy Orton into the steel steps. Randy's cut open across his face. It looks that way anyway. Triple H bouncing his head off of the table. No, Randy Orton going for that signature back suplex onto the announce table that he does. Reversed by Triple H. Yeah, Randy Orton has cut himself. What's Triple H thinking now? Maybe looking for the back suplex. Yes, he does. Triple H hits the back suplex on the announce table to Randy Orton instead. And Triple H appears to be cut on the top of his head as well. This is cool. Guys, I wonder how many matches Triple H has left. I really want to see him fight AJ Styles at some point. But, you know, if, if this leads to something at WrestleMania, then I don't mind. But I don't think it is. I think it's just a one-off while the Fiend's away. Just to give Randy Orton something to do. Triple H got the sledgehammer. His signature sledgehammer. He has got it in hand. Is he going to use it on Randy Orton? Once again, ladies and gents, because this is a fight, not a normal match, anything goes. Hunter now slowly making his way up the ring steps, making his way in the ring. The Vipers down in the other corner. Is Randy Orton going to get hit over the head with a sledgehammer? Oh no. Thunderdome screens have turned off. Is it him? Is he back? Or is it her? Will it be The Fiend or will it be Alexa Bliss? The lights have gone out once again. Randy Orton's realised... Whoa, 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 whoa! Whoa! Triple H's sledgehammer has caught on fire. Seemingly out of nowhere. The lights are out. Where's Triple H? Where's the fire? Triple H is gone. Triple H has disappeared. Randy Orton in the ring. The lighting's pink. We know what that means. It isn't him. It's definitely going to be her. Alexa Bliss. Where is she? A distorted version of the Firefly Funhouse theme playing in the background. And there she is. Little Miss Bliss standing in the corner with a sadistic look on her face at Randy Orton. Last time we saw her, Randy was... Well, we don't know if Randy actually set her on fire or not, but he was going to. What's Bliss thinking here? Randy Orton looks confused. Looking around, is the Fiend going to be here? Bliss slowly approaching the Viper. Which hand is she holding up? Pain! Holding up the pain hand! No! Oh my god! Oh my God! Alexa Bliss just shot a ball of fire, a fireball at the face of Randy Orton. He might be blind. Randy Orton just took a fireball to the face. Oh my God! Is he all right? We still don't know where Triple H has gone, but Randy Orton just took a fireball to the face. Similar to what Keith Lee took from Karrion Cross in the summer. That is brutal. But what's next in the Fiend storyline, guys? What's next for the Fiend versus Randy Orton? And more importantly, where's Triple H? We just don't know. What do you guys think? Tell me in the comment section down below. I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.